Item number SCP-3247, Object Class Euclid. Special Containment Procedures SCP-3247 is to be contained in an isolated chamber in Site-5. Note, personnel are to be reminded that this is an error. Site-5 does not exist. Update, Area 12's Arachnic Wing. SCP-3247 has shown no need for sustenance or rest. Though as per Ethics Committee request, a television has been installed in SCP-3247 cell along with a selection of silent films. The feeding system for SCP-3247-A has been fully automated and should deposit 20 grams of live crickets on a weekly basis. In the event of a containment breach, personnel are to compel escaped SCP-3247-A instances to take on an immobile form and place them back within the cell. Description SCP-3247 is a humanoid entity roughly 1.7 meters in height. The entity wears a striped pullover with suspenders as well as white makeup on its face and exposed skin. Testing has revealed that SCP-3247's clothing and makeup are unable to be removed and are suspected to be part of the organism. Further testing of SCP-3247's physical properties is hindered by its primary anomalous effect. SCP-3247 is intangible and thus incapable of directly interacting with any matter, with the exception of SCP-3247-A instances. SCP-3247 is host to a colony of arachnids, designated SCP-3247-A, which live on and within the entity. SCP-3247-A instances are defensive of SCP-3247 and are easily provoked, and they instinctively swarm organisms in SCP-3247's vicinity. If, however, scp 3247A witnesses a human subject pantomiming or making particular gestulations. The colony will coordinate and order themselves in a rough approximation of an inanimate object based off this body language. SCP-3247A will remain in this state for up to three hours or until prompted to shift form. While they are in the shape of an object, SCP-3247A take on some of the object's properties and are somehow able to function despite being composed wholly of spiders. SCP-3247 has to date not attempted to speak to staff, with its attempts at communication being limited to miming actions. SCP-3247 has not expressed discomfort in hosting SCP-3247-A. Though it does display annoyance due to their mimicry prompted by its own gestulation, Presumably because the use of props is anti-theatrical to SCP-3247's preferred method of performance art. Testing Log SCP-3247-A Test Number Gesture Procedure List of gesture performed and any procedural modifications. Results Outcome of Test Test 3 Gesture Procedure Closed Fist with both the thumb and index finger extended. Results. SCP-3247-A situated themselves in the form of a handgun. After receiving clearance from control, DE-11424 was cleared to pick up SCP-3247-A and attempt to fire it. It proved capable of firing individual spiders at high velocity. Test 15. Gesture. Procedure. Thumb and index finger pressed together. Remaining fingers extended. OK. Results. Four dozen SCP-3247-A paired off to form what seemed to be marijuana cigarettes. D-11424 was successful in lighting and smoking one pair until they were reduced to ash. D-11424 reported feelings and sensations consistent with the typical effects of cannabis. With the accurate fact of perceiving all humans as possessing arachnid heads while within his visual periphery. Test 128. Gesture Procedure. Subject held hands together and wriggled four fingers on each hand, pentomiming a spider. 
Roughly 640 spiders emerged from SCP-3247 and divided themselves in groups of eight. Each group then came together in the shape of a larger spider. These groups themselves then merged with seven other groups to form even bigger spiders. This continued until the last remaining supergroups merged into one enormous spider made of spiders. It was at this point that D-11424 proceeded to ride the resulting Mega Spider in a fashion similar to Western bull riding. Subject was reprimanded after testing ended, but allowed to stay with the project. Test 133 Gesture Procedure Subject Shadow Boxed a mass of approximately 30,000 spiders emerged from the subject and continued to attack and incapacitate D-11424. Guards nearby had to interfere and bring D-11424 to the nervous infirmary. Test 475 Just a procedure, subject pantomime steering a wheel. Result an unprecedented number of spiders emerged from SCP-3247 and arranged themselves in the shape of a sedan. D-11424 reprimanded for refusing to get inside in order to attempt to start it. D-11424 responded to control by making a masturbatory hand gesture, to which SCP-3247-A responded by dismantling themselves and forming approximately 200 phalluses. Test aborted.